thanks to my new subscribers, Scoob2495, JustinJM466, Tylerman102, Haxrisfan, GabRJI22, MrPylord2, Chris P. Gaffney, Ultra Gamer Wolf, The White Darkrai, and XQEXUAVX. Today I'm going to start opening a Great Encounters booster box. So Alright guys, so I've had this box for a few weeks now, but I've, I've sort of been putting off on opening it, uh, mostly because, you know, I had the pre-release and I've been working a lot. So it's partially not having time, partially I've had other stuff to open, so now I think is a good time to finally open this. So here's the front. Uh, the theme colors of the set are, you know, blue and gold. A nice combination there. We have uh, Cresselia down here. On the side we have Dialga. Other side is Palkia. And the top is Darkrai. We have the back with all four and text. Again, you can read if you want to. Bottom nothing. So yeah, let's crack this open. I can figure out how to open it. There we go. Maybe. Good enough. Now, I've never actually opened a Great Encounters pack before. So, my uh, set counter will be completely blank for the first time. Oh, I don't know when last time I had a blank uh, set counter was. Maybe ever. And speaking of the set counter, which should be up uh, shortly, a couple minutes or so, it is redesigned. Um, it's now just a partially translucent border on both sides now. Let me fix this. Yeah, on both sides over here. Um, it's just going to be black, um, but instead of having like text at the bottom when I complete uh, a thing or I complete a uh, type type of card like common, uncommon, rare, etc. Um, or not getting any new cards the set counter is actually going to change color so it will stay black uh, for you know just normal uh, updates um, if there are no cards it'll turn red and if I complete uh, you know like I said a set of cards then it'll turn blue so I figured it's a less intrusive way of doing things, plus it looks pretty cool too. Uh, my problem with the uh, Black Starry one was it just didn't look that good. Like, it was better than my original set counters, but the way it is right now is just so much better, I think. Okay, so that'll be up shortly, like I said. So let's check out the packs here. Alright, so we have Darkrai, Cresselia, Palkia, and Dialga. Very cool, it's like gold, as you can tell. It's neat. Seems like it's higher quality. Seems like it, it isn't, but it seems like it is. Come on. Alright, so I'm just gonna open 12 packs straight in this video, no cuts, unless. You know, I get distracted or something. So, let's get this started. And this will bring up the set counter. First pack is Dark Rye. Okay, one, two, three, one, two. Quite some little bent for some reason. It's weird. Alright, we have a drowsy Jigglypuff with creepily large eyes. Ball toy. Torchic. Wingle. Cacturn. Granbull. 
very jolly ramble, I should say. Sorry if the... Seems like, it seems like it's a little dark, but it's okay. Relicanth Reverse is an uncommon Perugly. That's cool. And the rare is a Hollow Pachirisu. That is nice. I'm really enjoying the artwork on these cards so far. It's pretty neat. Of course, yellow sleeves for the gold set. Cool. Pack number two. Cresselia. Yeah, like I mentioned, it, it seems like uh, the video is a little dark, um, but I have natural light in the background too, so. Might be causing a silhouetting problem. <clears throat> Volbeat. Krabby. Iglybuff. Soul Rock. Illumise. I'm not sure if it's Illumise or Illumise. Zangoose. Gorbis. Leftovers Trainer. Reverse is another Illumise. And the rare is an Altaria. Non hollow. Cool. Actually, I should note this is number 12 out of 106. So that means there aren't very many hollows in this set. I mean, you guys can tell based on the counter over here, but I don't have the luxury right now. Here's Palkia for pack, pack three. Two, three, one, two. <clears throat> Swablu. Coughing. Tangela, Slowpoke, Zigzagoon, Sviper, Togetic, Delibird, Reverse is an unknown H, and that's a rare. Cool. I hate unknowns. And the rare is a non hollow Beedrill. Alright. So far, not bad. Pack four with Darkrai. I gotta say, it's nice to open packs that are easy to open. Uh, the last packs I opened were the Emerging Powers Pre-Release packs, and those packs suck, like, really bad. I don't know why, but they're just awful. Right. Love Disc, Snubble, Torchic, Trico, Makuhita, Arbok, Zangoose, Gorbis. I always forget this Pokemon exists. I'm not sure why. Um, probably because I never played the third generation games, but whatever. Reverse is Leftovers, and the rare is a Latios. Alrighty. Number five. Cresselia. Phoebus, Trico, Lunatone, Togepi, Clan Pearl, also heavily forgotten, Seviper, there we go, Togetic, Delibird, Reverse is a Latios rare, that's cool, so this or the other is for trade, and the rare is a Dialga, non hollow. So through, what, five packs? Yeah. Through five packs, I only have one hollow. Not too good so far. But again, there, there are only, what, ten or eleven in the set, so... It's not all that surprising. Three, one, two... Illumise. Love Disc, Snubble, Torchic, Trico, Cacturn, 
Jolly Granville. Relicath. Reverse is a common slowpoke. And the rare is a Waylord. With a lot of HP. Oh my. It's an interesting Pokebody. Combined with the attack. This attack puts it to sleep. And as long as it's asleep, between turns, take off one damage counter. So, with the 200 HP, it's pretty hard to kill. Okay, halfway through part one, six more packs. Palkia. Kakuna, Mudkip, Iglybuff, Houndor, Weedle, Rare Candy, very useful, Perugly, Slowbro, Reverse is a Tangrowth Rare Hollow, it's pretty cool, and the Rare is another Unknown H. So that is for trade. Just make sure I'm right here, okay, yeah. Captain Great. Three, one, two. Porygon. Coughing. Kakuna. Torchic, Wismer, Mag Cargo, Porygon 2, oh, Marsh Jump and Reverse is a rare Dialga. So I've got a lot of uh, Reverse rares, but unfortunately they've all been ones I had. And the rare is a Primeape. Hmm. It's still been a while since I've had a actual Hollow. As opposed to a reverse hollow of a hollow. So that's the first pack. Yeah. Okay, weird. This is pack number nine, I think. Unknown L. Full beat. Krabby. Bigly buff. Soul Rock. Zangoose, Gorbis, Leftovers, Reverse is a Combuskin Uncommon, and the Rare is, nice, Hollow Ro Rotom. Pretty cool, nice artwork. Looks almost real, look at that. That's nice. And a sleeve. Let's just make sure, I think there are three packs left. Three, six, nine, yeah. Three more packs. Phoebus. Kakuna. Baltoy. Togepi. Unknown L, Perugly, Slowbro, Arbok, Reverse is a Hariyama Uncommon, and the rare is nice, Hollow Darkrai. That is really, really cool looking. The moon in the background, and yeah, it's nice. Cool, two hollows in a row. Cannot complain. Two packs left in part one. Weasel. Swablu. 
Mankey, Cacnea, Slowpoke, Porygon 2, Marsh Stomp, Rare Candy, Reverse is a Rare Palkia, that's excellent, and the Rare is a Wigglybuff, non-hollow. Okay, last pack of part one, and it's Darkrai. I would love to level X right about now. That'd be cool. Two, three, one, two. Porygon, which I just noticed is very fat. Hmm. Phoebus. Kakuna. Baltoy. Togepi. Loudred. Skarmory. Huntail. Reverse is a common unknown L. And the rare is a non hollow sloking. Alright. Not a very exciting part, but, you know, it happens sometimes. That only means that parts 2 and 3 will be awesome. So, stay tuned for those. Like I said, that's all for part 1. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Comment, rate, subscribe. Check out my channel and my website for trade information. And that's it. Stay tuned for part 2. Thanks for watching.